In this video, I'm going to continue working on this assignment. It's Project 8.1, The Button Maker. In particular, I'm going to work on this part. It's on page 6. It's part number 21. It's the upper die center support. I'm going to create this part and this drawing. I'm going to start out by creating a new part. And a new sketch. On the XY plane. I'm going to create a two-point center rectangle. Starting at the origin. Enter 4.625, tab 1, enter. I'm going to use my point tool and place a point approximately there and there. Choose your dimension tool. Dimension this point. Enter point two one nine. Enter one point zero oh six three. Enter 1.625. Enter 0.688. Finish your sketch. Extrude. Go in the reverse direction and make the distance 0.625. In your browser, go to your extrusion, open up the folder, and right mouse button over the sketch and turn the visibility on. Select this point, select your hole tool. It should be a simple hole, through hole. The diameter should be 0.25, it should go through all. Select OK. Select your hole tool. The diameter should be 0.188. Once again, it should be a simple hole and it should go through all. Select OK. Come back to this sketch and turn the sketch off. Create a new sketch on this top surface. Turn on construction. Select project geometry and project that face. Select your line tool and select this midpoint and draw a line across to the other midpoint. Turn off construction. Select your point tool and place four points on this line you just created. Select your dimension tool. Make this point three one three. Make this point three one three. Make 
make this 2.125. Make this 2.813. Finish your sketch. Select this point. Select your hole tool. And this diameter should be 0.25. It should be a simple hole and it should go through all. Select OK. Come back to this hole you just created and turn the visibility of this sketch on. Select this point and hold your shift key down and this point. And select your hole tool. The diameter should be 0.313. A simple hole through all. Select OK. Select this point and your hole tool. The diameter should be 0.438. A simple hole through all. Select OK. Come back to this sketch and turn the visibility off. Select your chamfer tool. Set the chamfer distance to 0.03 and select all edges. including all the holes and all edges. Select OK. I missed two. Select Chamfer again. And select these. And select OK. I'm going to create two work planes. And th these are going to be to simplify assembly. Select mid-plane between two planes. I'm going to select this face and this face, the back face. And that puts a work plane right down the center of the part. I'm going to do that one more time. Mid-plane between two planes. Select the top of the part and the bottom. And there's a, a bisecting work plane right down the center of the part. Go to your eye properties and go to physical and set the material to steel. Go to summary. Change the title to 21 Upper Die Center Support. Change author to your name. Under Project, set the part number to 21 and set the description. Set the description to Upper Die Center Support. Select OK. Select the Material Finish. and change the material finish to steel polished. Save your part. Create a new drawing. Place your base view. Set the scale to 2 to 1.
select your ISO view and turn on shaded. Select annotate and select, select your center mark tool and point to the to all the holes. Select your center line bisector. Select these midpoints. Select your hole and thread tool and point to these holes. Choose Dimension. Don't select the beveled edge, select the outer edge. Select chamfer, point to the beveled edge and to this edge. Select this line and drag it across and the same here, drag this one across. Choose your dimension tool again. Select Eye Properties, go to Summary, change the title to 21 Upper Die Center Support, and change the author to your name. 
verify that the revision level is A. Your title block should look like this. Go to File, Export to PDF, save the file in your Documents folder, save your drawing, and submit your drawing, your PDF drawing to Project Lead the Way to complete your assignment.